Oh my god, guys. Oh my god. Thank you so much, man. What's up, 67 Let's go. Today we're here doing a ranked 1v1. And I cannot thank you enough because look at this shit. This was the original spike. 173. I commented about it. Boom. 174. You beat it. And then completely obliterated. 273. Literally 100 subs more. Well, I guess technically 99 subs more. I haven't had a spike like that. I haven't had a 273 sub spike for years. Literally years. It's it's actually been years since I've seen something like that. That being said, I, I'm completely mind blown. I'm so... I'm so mind blown by that, by the support, because it was literally five... Oh my god, I'm sorry, I keep burping. Literally five days ago, five days ago, that um, that I commented about hitting 77,000 subs and how excited I was. And now we're at 70, hold on, let me go to my dashboard and I'll tell you. I can't show you this because it shows my revenue and I think I'll get banned on YouTube if I show that, but 78,068 subs. Oh my god, dude, we're at 78,000 in just a couple of days just a couple of days and you guys got me a thousand sub i i can't thank you enough i'm doing something for you right now and if you haven't noticed by our if you haven't noticed already check the length of this video it is going to be a one hour long video um just as like kind of a thank you for for the phenomenal support like the the most incredible support that i've ever received period i think on my youtube channel in a single day is 273 subs i'm pretty sure um i can't thank you guys enough for it and i'm doing i'm doing a one hour video you guys asked for it a couple times i thought you were trolling um i still think you're trolling <laughs> but um dude Oh my god, I have my headphones in the wrong way. Hold on. Hold on. <laughs> Give me a second. There we go. I heard him. I saw him go to my right. I saw him run past me on the right. And I heard it on the left. There we go. Much better. <laughs> so weird. <laughs> okay. We're good now. I'm stuck. I can't, just can't move. Okay. Um, I think I want to max my two. He cleared wave. That's all right. He won't be able to get this, will he? Is he actually going to fight me for it? Oh, he is. Okay. All right. I don't think I quite have uh, the slow necessary. Should I alt him here? Hmm. I think instead of using my mana to alt, I'm just going to use my mana to get this red buff. I will use my one, pretty much just because it helps me clear just a tiny, tiny bit faster. Grab this, grab these. Two mana pots because clearly, like, they, they nerfed the mana. <clears throat> oh my god, my voice cracked. Don't talk about it. They nerfed the mana of, uh, of his two, so like, or I guess they buffed it technically, but they lowered the amount cost um, for Rom's two. Which does help him a significant amount, by the way, I will say. 
Um, but it's still not quite enough, in my opinion. It is a huge steroid, though, so maybe it is. I don't know. I don't know. I am maxing my two first, by the way, just because the steroid, I think, is probably more valuable than a little bit of extra damage. Ah. That was really unfortunate that uh, I missed my last shot. I wouldn't have killed him, I don't think. But it would have at least given me the opportunity to see if it would have killed him, you know? <laughs> you know, I, everyone talks about uh, those options, those... Uh, oh my god, what, what is it? What is that saying? You're always rejected if you never put yourself out there. Some, some stupid shit like that. It's always a no if they don't have the option to say yes. You know, something like that. That's how I feel with that all. Like, it probably wouldn't have killed him, but what if it did, you know? <laughs> that, that's how I feel right now. <laughs> Alright, I will end you, sir. Yes, there you go. What's my, what's my steroid at? 45%. It's pretty high. I think next item is Aussie, and then after that might be... I don't know. Yeah, I have a 1.8 attack speed. Oh. Can you don't? Come on, give me the mana, give me the mana. Oh, damn it, I don't have mana. Oh shit, does he have blink? Oh shit. Shit! Oh! Oh my god, oh my god, I saw my life flash before my eyes. Oh my god. Oh my god, and then I got the red buff and lived. <sighs> you cannot end me! The clutch, the clutch snipe, dude. Oh my god. Oh, that was so exciting, holy shit. That gets the blood pumping, man. That gets it pumping. <laughs> nice. Nice, 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 nice. I hope you don't mind me stealing this from me. Do I do a ton of damage, though? Boop, boop, boop. I do actually a shit ton of damage. <laughs> it's probably not worth it for me to take tower shots to do no damage if I were to guess. I'm dead. I don't have Aussie, man. I don't have my lifesteal, dude. If I had my lifesteal, I would have had it, but I'm ass. He also just warded here. Um, I tried pinging, but I forgot that you need to not be buying items. You warded those two spots. <clears throat> Which I don't know why he would do that, to be honest. Like, if he wants to see me go for, like... He probably did my blue. 
I think it's a pretty safe assumption to assume he did my blue. Okay, he didn't. Fantastic. Now I look like a dumbass. Mystical mail? That's not an item I would have purchased because I'm gonna go Kins with 2.5 attack speed. Aussie and Ichabal. So Kins definitely wouldn't have, uh, or Mystical Mail definitely would not have been on my radar. Like, crowd control reduction, literally useless. 300 HP doesn't help him that much. I mean, it does right now, I guess. But for how much longer, you know? Like, how much longer is that actually going to help him? Realistically, three more items? You know, like, it can't be that much. Well, that's just super shitty, isn't it? Can I get his tower with this, though? I did poke him out, so he did back. Nah, I can't get tower. Oh, he didn't even heal all the way. Oh, he's going Talaria Boots, Defense, Defense. They're gonna dive me, huh? That's the play. Oh my god! He actually killed me. He actually killed me. Wow. Well, I stand corrected. Um, What's a good relic? For this matchup, honestly, like a cursed onk. I get toxic blade and upgraded onk, and then I just beat his ass when he ults. He does have double defense, so he uh, he could probably just tank that tower and, and take it. But he's not going to though. This guy kind of plays like a wiener. I think his ward ran out yet. He's got to hide. He, I think he's got to hide. I think he probably got it when he killed me. At 2.16 attack speed with my steroid. That's pretty, that's pretty up there. Yeah, he has a finished hide already. Damn. That really is up there. I could have bracered, by the way, but I didn't know, like, for, you know, when he was diving me, I didn't think that the, he could two and then auto-cancel with the two and just, like, kill me instantly. I didn't think that was a thing. No ward again. He has a lot of sustain. Or, I mean, I guess not real, not technically a lot of sustain, but it ends up being like that because he's so tanky. Not doing full, is he? Oh, he was back. Okay, okay.
Alright, well... I'll take it, to be honest. I'll take that. Uh, I'm gonna go Toxic here. We, we got his alt and his thorns. I've been really silent, man. Like, I, I, I gotta fucking focus. I gotta focus in this game because it's not easy. It's not easy, <laughs> this match. Okay. That was really nice. Can I get power? Nope. He is very fast. Bracer. Your middle tower is under attack. He is very tanky, huh? Oh. If I had Toxic Blade, I probably could have killed him, but uh I didn't. Your middle tower is under attack. I think we go I think we go Titan's Bane, to be honest, next item. We don't need attack speed. We don't need attack speed at all. And we have enough life steal, so let's just go Titans. I mean, defense honestly wouldn't be bad, but I don't know. I'm just going to pop all my pots because I think that this is going to be a pretty long fight here. It wasn't a fight at all. Not yet, at least. Minions, I need to get the tower and bull demon. Uh, I can't do both, dude. Fuck. Uh, I'm going Titan's Bane. I'm going Titan's Bane. I need to stop him from doing bull demon. Okay, we can do Bull Demon now. Oh my gosh. I shredded him when once I got this Titan Spin online. Oh my god. I I obliterated him. 
And I caught his dash with my three, which was pretty nuts. Pretty lucky, to be honest. He has hastened. I gotta watch out. Nice! I hit the snipes with the Ankh up and I was able to get the kill. I already had the Bull Demon and I had a full wave, so that would have been the game. Fuck yes. 20 minutes in, first win down with a sick ass ROM game. Swag, 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 swag. Mm. Swag, 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 swag. Mm. Swag, 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 swag. Mm. Swag, swag, mm. swag, 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 swag. Mm. Alright, queue up again. Hit that GG button. Oh, I got a champion chest. What do we get? Five XP boosters. Well, that's pretty fucking lame. I have all these chests. It's like seven emo chests, but I have every emote in the game. And then I have these cutesy chests, but I have every cutesy avatar in the game. So now I'm just sitting here chilling. Like, what do I actually do? I have something. Well, there you go. That's fine. That's fine. I was gonna queue. Uh, I was gonna queue with 2.0 after this recording is done, but uh, well, no, I guess I can't. Um, what can I talk about in between these queues? I don't really have anything to talk about in between these queues. I don't really know. I could fidget spin. I forgot I got this during that fidget spinner. Freight, K, freight, K's, craze, phrase, craze. Um, ready when you are when I'm back on my to do. All right, brother. See you then. Whenever that is. Um, look at this. Look at this. My... My conquest, I'm doing really well in conquest, by the way. Eight and two um, with diamond two MMR. Uh, diamond one. It, if I win this game, uh, I'll get promoted and I'll probably be promoted to like diamond three, I would assume. Um, you know, I've got diamond one MMR for joust and then for duel is my lowest MMR. I don't even understand, dude. I don't understand at all. But, you know, whatever, I guess. Fuck it, you know. You fuck it. You fuck it. You yeah, yeah, fuck it. Um, what do I do, man? These long cues. Let's drink some, uh, let's drink some Diet Mountain Dew. Uh, should I wait for you to finish your duel or just queue and wait till tonight? Um, just queue and wait till tonight, I guess. Since you gotta go regardless. All right. I also I was gonna queue with Marvels yesterday, but uh, but he's in Diamond. Um, so I have to get promoted before I can queue with him because in the the way that they made the queue system for Conquest really stupid for duo if you if you're gonna duo queue uh if you're in diamond you have to be 50 mmr at the maximum 50 mmr at the maximum difference um and for platinum or lower it's a 200 mmr difference so because he was in diamond and i was in platinum um it because he's in diamond it had to be 50 apart and i was 75 over him because he had, Marvels has twenty one twenty five and I had twenty two hundred, so I would I had too much elo for him to queue with me, even though he was a higher rank than me. It's so bullshit the way this MMR system is uh, is messing up duo queue. Like Hyros put duo queue back into the game, and then was like, you know what? We're gonna put it back into the game, but nobody's gonna be able to use it. <laughs> it was crazy. It was crazy, dude. Uh, so I played I played ROM. What was the other? Let me go to my YouTube uh, this video and see what would the other comments and see if uh, see what else you guys wanted to see here. Happy to help. Uh, ROM game after the debate. I got you with it. Um, can I get a Hades game for the nostalgia? All right. I'm down for a Hades game. Yes. Ryzen, hey! 
<laughs> All right, I can put some respect on Raijin is a fucking force to be reckoned with. I've fought a lot of Raijins in my in my in my time. I've fought a lot of Raijins, and for whatever reason, I almost always lose to them. Almost always. I think Blink is probably the best relic here, because I won, or I like I Blink auto fear. He dashes away. And then I dash onto him, he ults, and then I ult, but his ult is so slow, so my ult will probably trade his ult uh, pretty well. Oh man. I'm having a lot of fun with Smite recently. I started playing a lot of Conquest on my stream. Uh, just because it's like, you know, it's different, and I, it's, it's fun, man. Like, don't get me wrong. I get mad because, you know, people BM me, uh, you know, because I'm a dual player and I'm known for dual, people all the all the fucking time are like, yo, you queue the wrong mode, bro, you know, even though I'm the top elo in their game, <laughs> and they're like, yo, you queue the wrong, you, the wrong mode, bro, I'm like, but it's still fun, man, I really do enjoy it, honestly. Jeez, I did a lot of damage. He's giving me red buff, I think. Yeah, he's giving me it. Alright, hell yeah, dude. Just using my mana pot. Maybe he is doing his blue? No, he's not. Oh... He doesn't have his dash. Okay. Okay. Thank you, minions. <laughs> Ooh, I needed that. I needed your help, minions, because that was just terrible. Oh, man. He didn't have his dash, and I got the entire wave exploded onto him. Jesus. And by the way, one, one good thing about this hour-long video... Um... Besides, you know, the fact that I get to play Smite for an hour, is, um... <laughs> okay. <laughs> he, uh... He dashed onto the wave. He dashed onto the wave to, to try to clear it, so I just blink at him. But, um, this is a five-minute game, by the way, absolutely. But one good thing about an hour-long video is that you guys get to see like a decent recording session because this is normally what I do you know I, I record two three games and then I pick the best one out of those and then I upload them a um, lot of times a lot of times you can kind of tell this guy's given up by the way <laughs> um, a lot of times though it ends up being this you know like them not doing anything and I win the game by default because I did too well in the early game and I, there, I get a lot of shit um, for those games where I'm just messing around and um, I'm not ending the game when I could I get a lot of shit for that because people don't I think understand that it's difficult to get content in duel when a lot of the people you fight are this guy, <laughs> you know, <laughs> when they rush your tower down and you have to, you have to stop them from getting into your tower range. You have to kill them before they get in tower range. He, he literally sold his items because, because he's losing so bad. But, you know, whatever. Hour long video, you guys get to see this. The ups and downs of being too fucking good. <laughs> hey man, he's uh he's boosting my Hades stats, so I'll fucking take it. I will take it. Get away. Then get the red. Just kidding. What up, pussy? No. Well. Okay, you get you got me this time. I'm a bad 
I still got the kill. Oh my god. The time on that, man. The timer on that. It's gonna be so awful if this guy doesn't surrender at five. Like, if he makes me play this game out the way he's playing it. Oh my god, it's gonna be terrible, dude. Please. I, ho I really hope he surrenders at five. I really hope he surrenders at five. Because if he just keeps running down mid without surrendering at five, th those are like the worst types of people. Yeah, they're like they're like the worst types of people the people who um like if you give up like this i understand you know maybe you had a frustrating game before or something um but if you give up like this and then you don't surrender just to waste my time then it's it's terrible but at least you know at least this guy surrendered he's not he's not a scumbag he just had a bad last game oh i fought him last game didn't i wait was that was that the vamana i think that was the vamana Big oof. Big oof. All right. Play again. GG, friend. Oh, I want to show you guys something. This is how high my elo has gotten in Conquest. Um, this, by the way, Deathwalker, Adapting, um, Zeros. Um, this was Zapman, and this was, uh, was Baskin. I don't know who these two were, but I had a, I was playing a stacked fucking game, dude. Like a completely stacked game. And I actually held my own, you know, I kept up. The only problem was it, like we had no damage, so. Oh, by the way, this was my mid Jormungandr and support Nox. So I don't, I don't know if you guys noticed that, but this is, you know, I've been doing pretty well. Um, this game, this game was not my fault. This game was the Kukulin and the Terra just like... Actually, no, it was the X-Files fault, I think, right? No. I don't remember. What's the, what's the damage look like? Oh my god, X-Files did 10k, Kukulin did 7. Okay, you know what? It was just like a, com a combination of these three. It was a combination of those. But then, like, you know, this game, honestly was troll like this game was so troll i was support naja and uh i got the first two kills in the game and then we just snowballed everyone was just snowballing baka was going around eating ass hera was going around eating ass guan yu was 1v1ing the fucking vomana in solo lane it was crazy that was a troll game but then every other game i've just been uh, i've been jungling this one i i played solo because well i was forced to um but I did really good, man. This game I did really good. My damage isn't that high. Like it's it's I think it's where it should be, probably. Higher than the jungler and the support, but lower than the mid and the ADC. So it's it's where it should be. But um I had top mitigation that game. So I was I was really in the front line doing good shit that game. And then every other game it's just me jungling, you know, like 18 and 6 and uh, 12 and 6 and you know f this one wasn't very good to be honest this one I think they surrendered though yeah they surrendered at 14 minutes on this one so I didn't really get a chance to get to that that late game like alt in one shot people build this one I just demolished 10 and 1 I was I was running around just flopping on bo on hose 9 and 2 you know another good one Thanatos is my go to jungler as you can see in uh in conquest just because I really like him like I, the snowball aspect of it is just so fun to me to just be able to like snowball into a win like that with Thanatos. But you know, other junglers. Let me look at let me look at some assassins. I really like Ravana. Also, I don't know how he is in this meta, but I really do like Vamana. I really like Achilles. Achilles, I think, might be my favorite. To be honest, I don't play him much. I played him for one of my matches, and I demolished. It's not on my record or my, my recents anymore, but it, I did play him. Um, I really like him. Um, like, Daji is okay. I really like a Wheelix, even though I don't play her that much. I, I feel like I always do well with her in Conquest. Yeah, I don't know. I, I do really like a lot of Assassins, but my go-to, just, you know, if I want to... If I want to just try my best and... And... I'm pr I pretty much know that I'm going to hold my own. I picked Thanatos.
Oh man, we got ten more seconds. I hope I don't get a uh, another five minute game, or else this video is just gonna be that one twenty minute game, and then <laughs> and then a bunch of five minute games. <laughs> Which, you know, to be honest, if I'm playing duel for an hour, then that's most of the time what it's going to be, is just a bunch of five-minute games. I don't really ever get a lot of matches back-to-back -back that are, like, really good. I get maybe three or four good matches a day. I was just hoping that maybe all three of them would be right now. Because I think later when I'm playing, uh, or when I'm streaming, I think I'm probably going to be hitting up uh, some Conquest again. So I want to get in that die. I might go. I might go triple masters to split. I don't know. It depends on um, on how aids the MMR system is when you're higher ranked. You know, if the MMR system is fucked when you're higher ranked, then I might not. But if it's okay, then I I probably will. Um, let's do another Hades game because that last one, that last Hades game was shit. It was not good. It was just bad beyond belief. So. Kernanos, okay. Alright, so he has a pretty good matchup because if I use my one, he can alt me. Which is scary. So he's got a pretty good matchup. Good news for me is that he has a bad clear though. Good news for him is that he has a root. So if he does decide, um I'm gonna go blink again because of his dash. If he does decide to like know that I'm gonna proxy if he stands here or something. He roots me right there. I am 100% dead as fuck. Unless, you know, I can make my way over here, juke for three seconds and blink over the wall. You know, that would be, it'd be okay. It would suck a little bit because I'd be down a blink, but you know, whatever. Okay, good. He's not gonna proxy me. Or he's not gonna kill me while he while I'm proxying. I wonder if he's gonna do red. That would be a smart play. Kernanos can definitely burst red. He is doing it. Damn. I really wanted to like see if I could get that kill there so that he wouldn't uh so that he wouldn't have that red buff on him for very long because that red buff is gonna cause me some major issues. Okay. Let's just do this blue buff. I hope I can take this blue. He's still here. Get his dash. Got all of his abilities there. I probably should have died there, to be completely honest. Actually, I'm gonna stay because I have, uh, I have blue buff, so I have the mana to do it. To stay. Alright, let's get our Bancrofts. He's got finished Devos. Um, he did a good play. The early game should have been more in my favor, but he made a really good play going for the red buff. I'm not gonna lie. See, right now is when I would blink alt him and I would kill him. But um, the thing about that is I would need my blink and I would need my ult. Okay, clear that. Um, red buff actually is spawning really soon. 
So if I can get his dash, then I can blink alt him. That would be great. Hmm. He knew that I was going to blink alt him, and he backed. Good play, my friend. Good play. Will he have beads up, though, is the question. Alright, well, I won that trade so far. I don't even think you can dispute that. take it all right you know what I give a lot of respect to this man actually he's playing really well he's not overstaying or, or doing anything stupid he respects my cooldown he respects my blink and my alt he's playing really well nice plays dude nice plays he's playing like he does really understand this fucking game Kind of expected him to fight me there. I'm being an anise. Hmm. Yeah, I was wondering why I didn't do very much damage, and I don't know why, <laughs> to be honest. The greed. The greed, man. Everyone thinks they can outbox the Hades ult. I'm here to tell you, you can't outbox the Hades ult. <laughs> the ult gives you so much protection, dude. So much. 85 protection. So much protections. Not to mention, I get lifesteal from it, too, you know? Oh, another five minute surrender. He was playing so well, man. Just the late beads. The late beads and then he died. Made him go for the uh made him go for the swift ass surrender, dude. Feels fucking bad. Sorry, just answering a message. GG friend. That was quick. Blarg. <laughs> oh. Oh, that's how it'd be, huh? You're gonna fucking blarg me. Schlorgen blorgen. <laughs> he blarged and then schlorgen borgen me, dude. What the hell? Not cool, man. Not cool. Should I do another Hades game? No, I think two five-minute surrenders qualifies as the Hades game. Let's go back to the YouTube comments. Um, try a Yorm game for us. Hmm. Okay. <clears throat> a Jormungandr game. Ending off the one-hour video with a Jormungandr game. All right. Let's do it. Let's do it. I didn't expect to see that in the comments. <laughs> Jormungandr. Um, but he isn't ranked and he can be played. So I guess... Fuck it, dude. Let's try it. Let's try it out. I got to ban play Pele next. Hopefully he bans Merlin. I don't want to deal with Merlin. Not while I'm Jormungandr because that shit would be so annoying. I want him to play like King Arthur or like a Wheelix or like some bullshit like that, you know? <laughs> because he could never ult me. He could literally never ult me if he played King Arthur. Well, I guess he could with his stun, but not not with the knockout, not with the big ult. Or Naja. Oh my god. 
Yorm counters a lot of alts, actually. Don't ban Yorm. I swear to God, if you ban Yorm, I'm going to be upset. He's spaghetti. Come on. Come on. Oh, what did I say? Alright, what are you banning, dude? You gotta ban something. Besides that. Yormanganda. Battle points booster. Oh, Loki! We'll use the recolor. Oh, shit. Yo, wait, 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 my three counters Loki. I can see it as stealth. Oh, shit. Oh, my God, wait. It's actually so great, dude. Okay, so what does this guy do again? Um... Wait, what does Submerge do? Merging through a toxic cloud creates two new ones. Oh. Um. Bonus damage. Consuming Bellow and empowers him up to three times while also dealing extra damage. Hello. Why, please, why are you pausing the game to say hello to me? <laughs> you don't need to pause to type. I'm Kevin Uwu Pussy. What? Kevin Uwu Pussy? Who is that? What is, what is a Kevin Uwu Pussy? God, this god is so fucking big. Holy shit. So loud, too. Oh my goodness. Oh, he's right there. <laughs> oh, it's not a knockback anymore, huh? Wait, his clear is really good. Yo, why is Yorm's clear actually really good? Oh my gosh. I actually have nuts clear, dude. Surprisingly doing really well so far.
<laughs> Ooh, Kevin, ooh, ooh pussy. <laughs> oh my god, dude. This god is crazy fun, holy shit. Yo, he does so much damage, dude. What the fuck? I actually do so much damage. He canceled my two, bro. <laughs> what the fuck was he think was what does he think was gonna happen right there? He thought he was gonna kill me? Oh my god. Oh my god. Ridiculous, dude. Ridiculous. Yo, you want me again or straight up frags? is blue. He doesn't know that I can see him when he's stealthed. He he actually got the back off. Okay, you know what? I'm impressed. Storm actually does do a lot of damage though. Peace. Why didn't he ult away? Why did he why did he think that that wasn't going to kill him? I don't know.
Alright. Let's back. Hmm. I fear as though that didn't work out exactly how he wanted that to go. He wanted to stop my back so that he could be annoying and uh, instead he ended up wasting a bracer because he couldn't kill me. My second relic. He actually got defense. For wow. Just throw that out of there. I'm kind of surprised he's not doing bull right now. Annoying, but good. I think Polly works, right? And demonic Intellikinds was a bug. Such like a look. Hmm. Just want minions to get into his tower range. So that I can take it. Damn. I need some more damage. Oh, a gem is going to be actually pretty good. How do I get his tower, though? Do I grab hide or something, also? Mystical mail, maybe?
<sighs> Annoying. Actually, really surprised you didn't go for the red there. Backed. Right. <clears throat> um, how am I ever going to get his Phoenix? Literally, ever. His tower, I think I can do. For the sole reason of I can just tank it once I get my hide. But after that, like, I don't understand how to get a Phoenix. I literally just want your tower. Stop being a prick. Hey. That would have killed me if I didn't brace her. Uh, I can't do Bull Demon, even though I'm bigger than Bull Demon, because it will kill me. But what I can do is go get my hide, and a couple of wards, and get a red buff, and then maybe try to do it. You know what? At the very least, he doesn't have an alt. Just clear this wave and uh, try to do Bold Demon.
Oh, all right, boys. All right, all right. The wave is clear, and we got minions coming in. Can we actually get a Phoenix against a Loki as Jormungandr? Holy shit, this will be phenomenal. Slow that wave down. Clear it. Wait for my passive. Two. Uh, can't kill me. It's annoying. This is Aegis. Upgrade this, upgrade this, get that. No. Shit. We killed each other. Oh, I need to I need to get a kill, man. Okay, okay, okay. This is gonna How much damage did Phoenix do? 1200. Holy shit. Okay. Um Oh man, please tell me he's not going to get red. Please tell me he doesn't have the ball sack to go up that far to get red. Okay, he doesn't. Good. Oh my god, he actually fucking got it. Oh my god. Uh, hold it over the wall. Your middle tower has been destroyed.
that is actually hitting them. Don't kill them. Okay, get the Phoenix, come on. Nice. Yes, we'll get the fucking Phoenix against a Loki. Yeah. <laughs> Thank fucking God, dude, for real. Holy shit. Hey, GG, boys. Win the game as Jormungandr versus a Loki after the Loki called me a pussy and spam laughed. That's how we do it. If you enjoyed this video, thank you again so much for the 270 subs in one fucking day. Until next time, y'all. Peace.